Hello everyone, Dollmaster here. So, uh, kind of want to do a little review video on my drill bit collection and what I use and what I like. I have a lot of different drill bits in this bag from work and um, nothing new today, but I figured we'd go over some of these. And so far, um, see how strong this magnet is on this snap-on light. I can almost pick up this 29-piece hyperstep set. See that? I can almost do it with this little pen light. But anyway, actually, you know, I don't really have a f exact favorite, but it'd have to be between the the Max. I've never used snap-on drill bits. I haven't heard that great of things about them. They're really expensive. But these are awesome. I bought them after these. These are the first professional series drill bits I bought. And then I realized that it would be really nice to have the hyper steps. A co-worker had this set. He let me borrow them. And I loved how they uh, centered up really easily without any having to center pilot hole or anything they just do it I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with these this is the db29 hsrg high speed steel uh, non-cobalt but so far they've been really durable i've been using using them as much as i can i haven't used many of the big sizes i used the half inch once and as you can see there's literally nowhere and uh, the 3 8 one got used probably 30 or 40 times. Yeah, I used it probably 10 times and then I uh, let my friend borrow a 3 8 Mac Cobalt bit and a 3 8 Hyperstep bit, uh, which he just gave back to me. Um, kind of a review, another person, I let use them professionally in a machine shop. And he loves both of them. But... Uh, he says if he'd have to pick, he'd probably buy the Hyper Steps. He says they both have a purpose, and I agree. But overall, the Hyper Step, I would say, works better and cuts faster. And time is money, right? So, as you can see, no skips in sizes. Now, they don't warranty these down under a quarter. You have to pay. Uh, so, this set here... You gotta pay if you break them. Uh, all of these, though, are a lifetime warranty. So let's check out the 3 8 uh, Hyper Step that's had about 40 drill, used about 40 times. So, as you can see, very minimal wear, uh, just a little bit on the tip. It's very hard to see, but. Just a little bit of wear on the tip, but not much. He said they still drilled great after him using them for about, uh, I think, three weeks. I let him borrow them. Mac, or Matco. And I think he said that this one um, maybe lost its edge a little bit faster. Mainly because it's bigger. It's not stepped, but a little bit, just a tiny bit of chipping on the edges here sorry trying to get this to focus um, so the Mac 3 8 did very well he said it'll just cut it doesn't matter how hard the metal is it just cuts it cuts slow though it doesn't cut as fast as the hyper step if you use a pilot hole first these cut fairly fast but uh, he really likes both of them, the Cobalt Max and the uh, High Speed Steel uh, Hyper Steps. So I think they're both good options. Um, these aren't Cobalt, so they're about 300, just over 300 bucks for the set. If you want to step up to the Cobalt set, you're running about 550 off the Matco truck. Sometimes you can find them on sale certain months for about 519 maybe five 
500. But nice set of drill bits. I like having different kinds because I do a lot of I do come across having to drill uh, really hard bolts out and fabbing up stuff every once in a while. So this set I've had longer, and these are lifetime all the way down. My dealer he'll he'll warranty them out. Uh, that's the nice thing about these Mac bits. Um, they just have a good, uh, extraordinary warranty program on these bits. That's what makes them so valuable. Um, so the 3 8 one goes there. As you can see, I've been using them, but nothing crazy. Probably use these smaller ones more, I think. And it's got this slot. You can put step bits in there if you want. I have a set of DeWalt ones I can put in there if I want. Uh, 730 seconds has been used, actually. Drilling out some hardened metal. You know, you start small and you just slowly work your way up. That's how you start really putting some wear onto these things. Like, one of these here, you can see it's shined up. They're really sharp, so let me... Okay, so this one, you can see it's starting to shine up because it's been used heavily. That one actually is getting dull, but sometimes you just go, you know, you don't use a lot of oil. But lifetime warranty, so if I have any problems, he takes care of it. That's the nice thing about having a good tool dealer. So all the way up to half inch, down in here. And uh, these I got before the price jumped on these. Uh, I think now they're about 400 bucks from Mac Cobalt. I got them for 359 right before the price increase in that last inflation jump. Uh, 29 piece Cobalt grade drill bit set. Part number 6338DSB. Another set of drill bits here. Um, these are invaluable uh, when you're a mechanic. Sometimes get in a situation where uh, you need to cut a drill bit in half. Sometimes you don't want to do that. And unfortunately, this isn't a 29 piece set like Matco now offers. Matco offers a hyper step 29 piece short length drill bit set. I think it's only cobalt. I don't think you can get it in the green case which is high speed steel so the cobalt mac cobits come in an orange case mac only offers cobalt for uh, these as well but this is a really nice set it only goes up to three eighths but these have been used at work a lot of different people use them and you can see this one's been used quite a bit I think I cut my hand I'm trying to pull that out of there. That one's been used. But yeah, these, see how short those are? They're about an inch and a half to two inches shorter than the uh, standard length drill bits, the mechanics length. So I'd recommend these. Obviously, they're going to be cheaper for this set compared to the 29 piece full length. I think these are about 200 bucks, maybe 189, about 100 bucks less, but just a nice set to have if you're in the trade and you don't want to mess around and you want to have what you need. Before I got this professional grade stuff, for many years I just ran regular old DeWalt drill bits and uh, Napa drill bits. Um, one of my favorite sets that I, I still use today is the black and gold DeWalt drill bits. And they make several different sets. You can get it in a 29 piece set. This is just a 14 piece set. And this is a brand new set. I have a used set at work too. I, these go on sale at Lowe's for about $10. $10-$20. And it's a really good deal. They're really good drill bits for the money. I highly recommend them. I've used the DeWalt Cobalts too. Uh, they're okay. But honestly these cut better. I don't know why, but the black and gold DeWalt 
drill bits. Includes a half inch. And they do okay in hard metal, surprisingly. Not as good as these these cobalt bits or the Matco hyper steps, but they do pretty well. And then if you want to save money and you don't really care about warranty, you can these aren't DeWalt's. I put them in a DeWalt case once my old set wore out. Uh, these I slowly purchased one at a time at, at Napa. And they're cobalt drill bits from Napa. And they're very similar to these Mac uh, cobalt drill bits, in all honesty. Um, they almost look the same. And they're very good quality. You can get the 29 piece set for about 200 bucks um, from Napa. I just bought a few individually until I replaced all the uh, bad black and gold. But as you can see, they're very similar. And the design and the color. So Napa Cobalt Carlisle bits, they're great. And then I picked up a set on clearance for $13 at Lowe's. Um, I think it's a 20, 21 or 22 piece Bosch drill bit set. Non-cobalt, but I think it's high speed steel. And they've been really good. I've been using them around the house. Um, just to wrap it up, I'll show you guys those. Been drilling wood and metal with them. And sometimes... If you want to have extra drill bits, but you don't want to spend a bunch of money and buy multiple tool truck sets, you can go with stuff on clearance at Home Depot or Lowe's. So let me pull those out. So these are the uh, Bosch drill bits. Um, it's not a 29 piece set. Um, I don't have the box anymore, but um, for the price, they're pretty good. I'll have to admit that. Um, they're normally about $30, 25 or $30, and I found them on clearance for like 10 or 12 bucks. And it goes up to half inch. It's not a complete 29 piece set, but it does cover most your sizes. So if you're on a budget and you don't want to spend tool truck prices uh, I think the Bosch drill bits are very good um, I've used these quite a bit around the house and they've, they've been pretty good um, some brands that I don't have here that I've already worn out bought a couple years ago I bought a set of the uh, Hercules drill bits the titanium coated drill bits from uh, Harbor Freight and they were terrible um, in all honesty they just even using oil they couldn't drill into shit they wore out prematurely and a friend of mine that I let borrow those two 3 8 drill bits the Mac and Matco he has a set of the Warrior 29 piece set uh, just basic titanium ones and they're terrible he even tells me that he's like I just buy them use them up because they're cheap but I don't like cheap drill bits in my opinion uh, and that doesn't mean if you got a set on clearance for ten dollars means they're junk. Sometimes you get lucky, and some of these brands are pretty decent, you know. Uh, 135 degree split point on this one. This is just the uh, Bosch standard drill bit, and the Dewalt drill bits are excellent. Same as Napa. So choose wisely, and if you have any questions, leave it in the comments, and I might be able to help guide you in the right direction if you're looking to buy a. Uh, either tool truck set of drill bits or just something cheap to get the job done for now but let me know and I'll uh, be glad to answer any questions um, please like comment share subscribe if you'd like to and uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks for watching